Welcome to another edition of Three Questions with Kevin. We're here in Newburgh, New York, the excitement capital of the world. Also the murder capital. But... Murder, excitement, that's why there's so much excitement, because there's so much murder. So Dan, my cousin here, we're here for his uh, birthday party as one, as well as Christina's. Um, but it's normally, they always have a get together here every year. We've had a great time today. I've done three questions with my cousin Michael, with my cousin um, Jeff, uh, with my sister, my sister Beth. Beth? Now, oh my Beth, God. Well, she's actually talking to me, so that in itself is a positive. <laughs> Dan, Dan, the way he works this, you've seen this, um, you've seen this a couple of times? Yes. Hasn't everybody? Who has it? I don't know who has it. Thank you. Come on, help me out a little bit, right? So the way he works this, why you rub my ass? I didn't think this was your ass, but no, that's okay. No, no, no. He was slow. All right, so the way it works is, ask three questions. There was a answer, fourth question, and you only have to answer the previous three questions. Got it? Got it. Great. First question is this. Dan, what's the most challenging part of your mother-in-law living with you? You know what? I think it's that we're both very different people, but we try to respect each other for who we are. I like, I think that's it. I respect her, and she respects me. We don't always have to agree on everything, but we love each other. That's it, I got no more for you on that one. Second question, Dan. I know that you only got your license about five years ago, yet you still don't drive. Eight well, years ago. Eight years ago, and you still don't drive. Yeah, you know, in, in layman's terms, WTF. I think it's probably more of a phobic thing that I'm afraid of where I grew up. He likes for his wife to drive him. He I do like for my wife to, to drive him. That's right. He you know what? Her, I'm he very wants her to drive. That's right. I'm very comfortable with my manhood. So, so that's the only answer, I guess. That's the only answer. All right. Third question there. Um, and uh, I see Bill Babe is twerking in the corner over there, but okay. <laughs> uh, back to the uh, task at hand here. Dan. What is your favorite episode of Curb Your Enthusiasm? I think it's the one with he, he and, uh, and what's his name, Lewis, I can't remember his first name, you know his friend, the comedian, I can't remember his name. Remember they go by the same bracelet? He wants to buy the bracelet for his girlfriend. Yes, yes. And, and really? he wants it for his wife, I love that one. Really? They, you don't remember that one? I do remember the one. I prefer the one when he, he takes the hooker so he go on the express lane. That's a funny episode. That's funny. You notice, by the way, the show is coming back, America. America is coming back. We're hoping to get Larry David on, on three questions, but you know what? He's Larry, got, he, why wouldn't you? This is Cap. He's, he's got to get online. He's got to get online. Beyonce yeah. is next. Beyonce wants next. No. No? How about no. Hillary? <laughs> You no would one like Des Killery and not acknowledge that you would like Des Killery. Oh, there's a lot of like Des Killery, but who wouldn't? Dan, you would you I like a lie detector? I want. We don't get involved with politics on this because there's a lot of people and friends that won't be friends anymore. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. I know what I'm right. talking about. I love, love you, Ben. All right, listen, we'll talk to you soon. Dan, thank you very thank much. Thank you. Good job. Love Man, right there. Love this guy. Take care.